I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations oh, Cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong, I was so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah you, you take all my wrongs and make them better Yeah you Thank you Thank you. Thank you all for supporting us and doing all you do. Hey, thanks for a thousand subs. Y'all are awesome. Thank you. We love you guys. We love you. We love you. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Welcome to four kids on a farm. My name is Aaron. I'm Rachel. We wanted to make a thank you video. If you guys are, have been following the channel, thank you so much. Uh, we just hit a thousand subscribers today. We got there so fast and it's because of a few people and we are so thankful for them. Um, you know, real quick, Jason at Coghill, Travis at Haas Tools, and Wanda and Danny at Deep South Homestead. I mean, we, we are in a collaboration with them as well as Adler Farms and Naked Hog. And it's been such an awesome experience these, this last week since it started. And it was just such a blessing for us to get that rocket boost into a thousand K. So we want to say thank you. Thank you. Um, and then beyond that, everybody, all of our subscribers, what, you guys like watching us do chores? What's the matter with you? <laughs> <laughs> we love you, oh my gosh. Like we can't even thank you enough. So the idea is we're gonna, if the weather cooperates, we wanna give a little tour. If you've been with us, we're gonna update you on all of our animals. If this is your first time, you're gonna meet everybody and our projects and we'll do it as fast as we can. And because it's supposed to rain, which is weird, in Northern California, where we're at right now, we don't get rain like after April. And here we are mid-May getting two days of rain. So which we will happily take uh, because if you look at our dry, dry pastures, uh, we need it. So to start with the baby chicks. So this is Cade, our second oldest. These are our new baby chicks. They're just a few months old and we have yeah two weeks no they're not two weeks a few weeks old yeah a few weeks old but so here these are the ones that hatched in our garden yeah and so, the mom's name is stinker yeah because she gets out of the coop all the time um here's some of our chicks this is brownie face Laura named her, obviously, <laughs> or him. This is Snuggles. So that's the baby chicks. We will now move on to our our manly rams, the rams with man parts that we use for our breeding program for our painted desert sheep. Okay, so these are our painted desert sheep. They're hair sheep, which means that they have two layers of fur, uh, the wool, <laughs> they shed during the heat. Right now they're looking pretty good, except for Gimli, our brown one. He's got like some dingleberries on him. So we're waiting for those to fall off. And then they look incredibly handsome. These sheep are very hardy and they taste delicious. So we separated them from the ewes because we don't want the accidental babies. Um, when they get together, they do the clashing and it's pretty epic. And when you do that, you want to give them a smaller area so they can't get a runway much because they can hurt each other. And so we gave them kind of a smaller area to be in. Uh, we'll, now that they're buddies, we'll probably move them over. And obviously there is a Lord of the Ring theme with how we name our dudes. So Elrond and Gimli, respectively. Okay, now we're going to the goats. Yeah. 
<laughs> we love the eggs they give us, huh? Yeah, There's man. Mr. Pantaloons. Hello, Mr. Pantaloons. Look at his pantaloons. Hello, pantaloons. This is Hey Hey. <coughs> he is uh, sneaking out. There he goes. Mr. Robert. That's free ranging, baby. We're going over to the sheep now. Should we show them the sheep? Yeah, let's show them our new baby lamb. Oh baby yeah, lamb. we got some baby lambs. Yeah, we got, you might know our new baby lamb, but we have like a new, new baby lamb yeah, too. He has fresh. a scrunch, she's like, he's like a scrunch fish. He's like four days old. Yeah. We're gonna go get him some hay. Someday, we wanna get this irrigated so we can just have green pasture all year round. This is our little baby lamb. Look at her cute face. So cute. <laughs> Hi baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for a sunflower. <laughs> <laughs> so none of them have sprouted out here, but we will show you in the very ends the one, the ones that sprouted inside um, under the lights. I think it's just because it's more of a controlled environment inside. Um, oh, where is one? Oh, come on, baby. Daddy, I think this is one. That's not one. What about Get those weeds out of there. So there's a sunflower. Uh, what about this one? That's kind of under the 
I just wanted to hedge my bets and do some inside, which I think is a good idea because if we get rain and it's cold for the next few days, at least I have some sprouting inside under a nice 76 degree temperature range with the right amount of water. But those ones are growing, so. But these ones are sprouting too, so that's perfect. Right there. Yeah, that fucking Oh yeah, baby. Oh, sunflower, y'all. Yeah. Oh, look, there's another one. Hey, woo, woo. hey, hey, we can, we can grow things. <laughs> <laughs> woo, I got a chance. I know, these are, these are, uh, run, these are runner beans. They're scarlet runner beans. And look at, they're just running up the side. Climb, 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 climb. Pretty soon they'll be on both beans. sides. Let's see if he will oh. grab. On here. <laughs> it's okay. I'm gonna make one grab on there. Here's the cocoon. If you look that way, it kind of looks like a soldier helmet. Kind of. <laughs> it does look like a soldier helmet, huh? Our camera think, think it's, Mom, thinks it's a cool head. bug. He's cool, huh? I don't know if he's good for the garden or not. I think he is. You think he's good? Because he found one on the flowers and it was sucking. Oh, I don't know. Might be a pest. I'm not sure. Oh, oh did it sprout? Yeah. <gasps> Wait, I saw my house. Look. Uh, what is that? It's a watermelon. It's sprouting. Oh, that's awesome. Is These it, are all the seeds the kids are growing. Are any for of mine sprouting? Farming yet? with Leon. We oh, gotta get more water on the bottom. You guys, we gotta get more water on the bottom of these. Is that it so will have a big watermelon. That's <laughs> so cool. Mine will be the first. One. Yeah, that's sprouting. AJ, I got a sprouting watermelon. Okay, we got one kid. <laughs> the rest uh, are off doing other things. So, guys, just a short trip uh, around our farm. We appreciate you guys 100%. Gosh, it's so crazy. Uh, this has been... Crazy! <laughs> we didn't know what to expect. We always are trying to do our best, and we are just proud and happy that you guys are part of our four kids on the farm youtube channel so whoa if there's anything you want to know questions nice comments um we, <laughs> we will nice. yeah put them below we appreciate them and we will end this video with uh, a little turkey singing to us <laughs> little clips of my little sunflowers that will soon be gigantic <laughs> thanks guys for being with us all right see you next time all right bye of all the magic places in the world i've been to this is where my heart is oh you know it's true no matter where i go i'm coming home to you okay shh hey we're doing a tour, so Quiet. follow the rules. Y'all are awesome. Oh wait, no, dang it. <laughs> okay, stop skateboarding. Taller than you. <laughs> you think you are. What do you guys think I am? <laughs> what is it? It's a sour blueberry. <laughs> oh, you're such a nut.